What's up guys, Vern here, Poggy Boy Productions. I'm here in Clifton, New Jersey. As you can see the sign behind me, I'm here at TikTok Diner in Clifton. We're here because I'm doing a video on a New Jersey secret cuisine that you can only find here in the East Coast, particularly in New Jersey. It's called Disco Fries. <laughs> so if you if you've been following our channel and watched a few videos, we've ordered it in a couple of restaurants. You see a little highlight clip here. Give me disco, disco fries. Basically, it's french fries smothered in gravy and mozzarella cheese. This place, this diner, I think it was one of the places that created the disco fries or made it popular here, depending on who you ask. So we're gonna go inside. Uh, probably gonna order out because I'm so full. And then, uh, yeah, keep watching. If you saw all those disco fries that we ate, I think my favorite one that we did, that we had, was the one at Topps Diner because you get to pour on that gravy as much as you want. That was the best. Taking it to go home. Yeah, baby. All right, here I am back home. Got myself this order. Like I said, I wasn't gonna eat at the diner. It was around 1 p.m. when I went and I was still full. So now it's about five, six o'clock and it's perfect time to go eat. So what did I get? I got the Mick Jagger special from uh, TikTok Diner. Now, legend had it that Mick Jagger was on his way to the concert, stopped by this diner, ordered himself this meal. And what's in that meal? Why they call it Mick Jagger? Let me show you. I'm gonna open it up right now. Still warm, surprisingly. This is what I got. What's inside the Mick Jagger special? Ooh, look at that. Of course, you had to have disco fries. Check it out. And this is their Taylor ham and egg and cheese sandwich. Now, if you're in Jersey, this whole debate about this, whether to call it Taylor ham or pork roll, me. Personally, I don't care. I'll eat it. <laughs> but over here, they call it Taylor Ham. So this is the Taylor Ham and egg and cheese sandwich. All right, let's start digging in. Oh man, look at all that gravy, that cheese all melted down to the fries. Oh my goodness, this is like drenched. It looks so good. This is definitely not good for my cholesterol and calories. It's gonna go up today. It's gonna spike up, but it's all worth it for you guys. Oh man, let me dip it in with some gravy. Mm. It's awesome. I love it. I love the skull fries. Mm. 
So, a little history on how disco prize was invented. Supposedly, one night after a night of disco dancing, late at night, two in the morning, they went to a diner and decided to create this. And thus, disco fries were born, you know? Pretty interesting. I don't know how true that is, but that's what I've read. Now, imagine if they <laughs> invented this now. It might be called hip hop fries or rave fries or techno fries, but you know, disco fries is not bad. So, this has been around for a while. Let's check it out. Mm. All right, now let's try the Taylor ham and cheese egg. I got the egg well done. Let's try it. This is heart attack inducing, I'm telling you. This is perfect for breakfast, but you know, diners are open 24 7, so you could order breakfast any day, any time of the week. It's pretty cool. So, uh, one bite. Mm. Mm. Really good. Like I said, look at all that meat. Look at all that ham there. The egg, the cheese. Oh man, this is really good stuff. One of the better pork rolls I've tasted, Taylor ham. <laughs> but yeah, I'm gonna have to try other. I might have to do a full video on Taylor ham pork roll debate and see where it is the best. But. If you are just from TikTok Diner, that's not bad. Pretty good. I love it. I mean, you can't go wrong. Look at that. Nice mix of flavors in your mouth. One more bite again. Another bite. Mm. This is very satisfying. Now, I call this whole fries Pool Man's Poutine. <laughs> so, I've been to Canada. That's what they are. Poutine. Instead of using mozzarella cheese, I believe they use cheese curds. We did a video on that, check it out. But uh, yeah, we enjoyed it as well. But so if you have a in for trying something similar to what it is, to Canada's version, which I think is the superior version, but you know, for a late night snack, this is pretty good. I mean, who doesn't love gravy, especially on fries? Cheese and gravy, such a great invention. <laughs> mm. Alright guys, here I am, Hoboken, Pier 13, we did a whole video on them, this is like a whole vibe, every summer, they have food trucks, beer, and uh, you can just hang out, enjoy the views, you see New York City right across, it's beautiful out here, anyway, I'm here for a food truck, it's called El Lechon de Negron, I think they have two stores or restaurants out, one of them closed down because of the pandemic, but their food truck business is doing really well, I'm gonna try out, um, what they call the lechon disco fries. This is their take on the disco fry, so let's go get it. Alright, so I was gonna try to eat over there, but there's too many people. It's just very pa packed at night. I mean, it's a nice night out, beautiful. Anyway, here it is Disco Fries. Check it out. I mean, you got the mozzarella, mozzarella cheese on it, you got your gravy, and you got the fries. Now, that what makes it special is, of course, the, the roasted pork, the lechon, the lechon bits. So, let's give it a try. Look at that, super cheesy, with all that meat hanging off it. <laughs> it looks pretty good actually. Um, I'm sure this is really good because I've seen lots of people buy it. Mm. Mm. That lechon, that, that smoky goodness adds more taste to the fries, gives me more reason get a heart attack later tonight <laughs> but oh man this is this is heavenly 
this is really tastes really that good there were people lining up ordering all kinds of stuff I mean I think they deserve a proper video and I think I'm gonna get Hunter and the rest of the guys to come out and eat it because they got other things like plantain sandwiches and one of their specialties of course the lechon disco fries yeah one more bite for you guys mmm mm. it's worth it look them up find them in the food truck order it anyway guys hope you enjoyed that video hope you guys learned a little about what makes disco fry special it was created here in New Jersey and you know it's such an easy recipe to make right just add gravy mozzarella cheese and that's what that's what it is right disco fries anyway if you're ever here make sure you just tell them, hey give me a order of disco fries even though it's not in the menu I'm sure they could make it for you and they'll know exactly what you're talking about so anyway if you're new here don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below hit it that real big red button uh, like comment and share give me a lot of likes and uh, I'll see you in the next video bye guys